Okay, so recently I made a short on an A10 Warthog, uh, which if you don't know what it is, it's a plane with a gigantic gun that shoots really fast. So here's how I made it. So here's the cannon, and it shoots pretty fast, which is pretty good, but now we've got two of them, which is even better. So now we're just going to make a few changes though, since it's not perfect. So after a bit of changing it, we've got this, which fires a lot better. Okay, so my plan is to hide the ammo in the wings. So that's going to be easier, so... Yeah, we just need to make the wings, so... Okay, so we're also going to start working on the body of the plane now. Okay, so now the body's done, but we kind of need engines to move forward, so let's make the engines quick. Okay, so now the engines are done, we just need to attach them, so just weld the one and... Yeah, it looks pretty good with one engine, but we still need the other, so let's attach the other one. And now the other, the other one's attached, and yeah, pretty good. Okay, but we still can't move, so I'm just going to put a switch down, connect it to the seat, connect it to the engines. And now we can move forward slightly. So yeah. Now we go slightly forwards, so let's add some upwards thrusters. Okay, so now we move forwards. We can change this later, but now we're going to get rid of the explosives on the wings, just so this doesn't blow up randomly, and so it's just a lot easier to work with. Okay, so I'm going to add some thrusters so we can turn. I've made an A and D converter, which will make it easy to turn with the A and D keys. But yeah, now we can turn. Not bad. But now we need to add pitch. Okay, so to add pitch, we're just going to add some thrusters in the front of the plane. So that's what I'm doing here. And also made an S converter, which basically means that when we press S, that's basically the sensor. Which basically means now that we, now we can like pitch up and pitch down. So yeah, now we can fly. Okay, so now we need is auto stabilization for a roll, because I don't want to have to manually control rolls. So I'm gonna make a gyroscope. At least that's what I think it's called. So here it is, and it'll basically just help us stabilize. So I basically weld some inside the plane, and if now I'm just gonna add sensors to the suspension glitch, and that will detect when we tilt too much. So now I'm just connecting logic gates up to the gyroscope, and yeah. Now all I've got to do is add some thrusters on each side of the plane. And yeah, now we can fly really well actually. And we don't have to worry about rolling. This thing is almost done, so we're going to add back on the ammo. Okay, so yeah, now it can fly and it can shoot, which is pretty good, but it does sometimes explode. Right, for example. Yeah. But yeah, it pretty much works. So yeah, we can work. So I hope I can the In the actual short that I posted, I did change the ammo bit, here's a clip. So it basically doesn't explode. Bye!